Hello and welcome to the Ryder Baseball pregame show. I'm Andrew Zajac, and here with me today is the Ryder Bronx first baseman, Justin Thomas. And Justin, how are you doing today? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing pretty good. I have a few questions for you. Now, being a senior, do you find yourself acting as a father figure to the younger players? I think so. Um, being here for four years, kind of as a person they want to look up to and knows what he's doing out there, knows what to do right in the right situation. So when it comes down to clutch time, do you think they really look towards a senior player? I think so, and we got a bunch of them. So I think they look at them knowing that they'll get the job done. So moving into such a big series game, do you find yourself doing anything specific to motivate your team? No, I think they know by now how important each Mac series is. And uh, the last two, we get to play at home, which are huge and they know how important it is to win the series. So then with a big series coming up and being at home, do you think it's that much of an advantage being 9-0 and now at home? Yeah, I think we, we like playing at home. Um, it's kind of like protecting our home field, and uh, everybody kind of gets up for home games. So the first 10 games the Bronx played, you were 2-8. and eight. In the last 10 you played, you're 8-2. and two. What did you guys do to turn everything around? We kind of stuck with it in the beginning. Um, It was really cold, and we were playing some really good teams. And then uh, recently, we've uh, just been getting hot and playing well together as a team, and uh, hopefully we keep it up. So you were talking about you guys got to play some difficult teams. Was Duke? How was Duke? How was playing Duke? Duke was a cool experience just because we got to go down there and uh, see what one of the top ACC teams, kind of how they play, and see their pitching staff, which probably is the biggest difference. So then after playing a team in the MAC and then playing a team in the ACC, can you definitely see a difference? Yeah, I'd say it's more pitching-wise because they, they got guys that come out of the pen that just fire it up there and hit spots. Um, position player-wise, I think we competed really well on that side of it, and we, we played really well all weekend down there. We just couldn't, couldn't get a win. So then moving into this weekend series, as a team, what do you think the Bronx have to do? to beat a team like Quinnipiac? I think a lot, as most teams, it starts with the starting pitching. Ours is great right now. As long as they keep us in the game, our hitters will get the job done like we've been doing all season. Thank you very much for coming today, Justin. And when we come back, we'll have the Ryder Bronx starting lineups after these underwritten announcements. You're listening to 1077 The Bronx and 1077thebronc.com.